when the smoke laden air is so thick, you can see it like yesterday and today. You may be wondering what is this doing to my lungs and does air conditioning give you any kind of protection? Well, the answer is yes, it impacts both. When the stuff in the air is this thick, there's some degree of particulate matter that is in the air and that can irritate your airways and cause people to go into a degree of bronchospasm. As for long-term damage to our lungs, Dr. Bill Barker, a pulmonologist with AHN tells me. We really don't have good evidence um, about long-term damage, but it's just wise if you have lung disease particularly, but if you are uh, young children or the elderly, to avoid really going outside um, on a day like today. In the healthy, Dr. Barker says you really shouldn't be aware of your breathing. And if they go out and they feel like the air is heavy or they feel like um, they're starting to wheeze or they just can't get all of their air out, um, it's time for them to to come back inside uh, to the cooler air. The good doctor points out that air conditioners have filters that can help protect you from the smoke and more. That can filter out some of the allergens out of the air, um, get some of the bacteria, some of the mold, some of the pollen um, that is out in the air and causing difficulties for people. But Dr. Barker says those filters must be changed. And if you haven't done it for a while, the buildup can be shocking. And just think about breathing that in, especially on a day like today, and that could cause some problems. Yeah, generally, Dr. Barker says if you're healthy, it's okay to go out, but he would avoid doing anything unnecessary or really stressful for the next, well, few days till this clears out of here. Okay, so filter wise, are some better than others? Yeah, absolutely. We've all heard of the HEPA filters. That's kind of the watchword, the buzzword. Dr. Barker says that the technology has vastly improved over the last 20 years. In fact, filters have ratings, and the higher the rating, the more it filters out, and generally, the more it's going to also cost mm. you. Mm. So, any kind of a filter change is a good idea until we get back into better conditions and it'll also help you breathe better. Yeah, so if you're sensitive, that's not the time to be frugal. Right. Your filter. Yeah, that's true. And if you haven't changed it in a while, you're going to be shocked when you see it. Mm.